All right, so a little bit of a preamble before we get into this. I suspect this is probably going to be a waste of time because I have a lot of experience debating Holocaust deniers. I know that generally speaking, when people form their opinions based on conspiracism, it's usually not because they actually have a vested interest in the facts. Uh, it's usually because they have like a set of biases that existed beforehand and they'll engage in like selective reasoning to adopt any beliefs that they can use to post hoc justify those, you know, pre-existing biases. I guess we'll see how much of a waste of time this turns out to be. So I wasn't that familiar with the specifics on this incident until I guess last night. 